It's a fucking tragedy! Not a feel good! Your ending is for morons. I'm gonna kill you, Sherry. I swear to God, I'll kill you. This is for normal people who live normal lives, who want to go home happy, singing the damn theme song. You got it? No, no. It means millions of dollars. Your ending is for fucking morons. Shit, I need a cigarette. Stop! It's a fucking red light! <laughs> If you're in bed with the girl and you haven't left yet, I'm gonna kill you. No, come on, bro. Chill, dude. Listen to me. This is very important. You have to bring the director's cut to the theater. The film starts in 20 minutes. I like a girl who eats and brings it up. Assassin mm -hmm. little frassy with bulimia. Her best friend's a plastic surgeon. And when a beam is in the shop, she rolls the bend. <laughs> What is your emergency? There is a bomb about to detonate in 15 minutes at the Warner Grand Theater. What are you doing? Fuck off my phone. Praise Allah and curse the enemies of Islam. Oh, hell no. Are you out of your fucking mind? What has gotten into you? Shut up. I'm so emotional. I'm leaving you. Fine, leave me. But for tonight, I need you to look beautiful for me. I need you to look sexy. Fuck off. I'm gonna fuck you later, girl. Hard. Fuck off. Do you want me to just pull over right here and let yeah, you Yeah, could you? You want me to? I'd like you to. Hey, to your own premiere? Oh, no, man. Hey! We have Valley Porky! Where's she going? I don't know, she'll be back. Did you call him? Did you talk to him? What the hell do you want me to do? I'm your manager, I'm not the fucking producer. I told you we need a lawyer. I can't believe the studio's fucking us. David, you remember Mr. Aseel, the head of Lion's Den? The studio that produced your film? I already lined up two sequels. Right, sweetheart? Right, Mr. A. Tell me you didn't use the third take, because the lighting on the second take made my abs look so ripped. No, I didn't use it. You look great, man. You're a star. Good. Good. Hey, you know, Nat is here. Nat is here. Hi, I'm Jules Basner for Z Entertainment. How are you doing tonight? Great, thank you good, for coming good. out. Good, good. How was it working with Andrea Starr? Well, she's a beautiful star, as you can see, and uh, she had to actually uh, gain 15 pounds for this part. Show us, uh, show us your uh, muscles, Andrea. Oh, oh yeah. fabulous. Her commitment's unbelievable. Hey, everybody, get out! Get out! situation here. This place may blow in five minutes. Cover the west end and the east side and make sure we got a perimeter set up. Everybody get down! They're always trying to push the little guy around. I've seen Hearts of Darkness 58 times and I thought to myself, what would Coppola do? Situation's under control. Looks like some prankster must have set this whole thing up. You'll be able to carry on with your event. You are such a man. You're so <laughs> handsome. Have you got a cigarette? Uh, no. Of course you don't. <laughs> have you ever considered acting? I have two national commercials running, and I'm up for a guest star on Everwood. Yeah. And if you come back to my SWAT truck, no, I'll be no, more than no, happy to be no. there. What? Not a penny. Fuck him. Yes, what'd you say? A headshot. You didn't get my message. It'll never happen again. You know you're the first white boy I've ever been with. You're just messing around with Andrea in the bathroom? Of course not. She's just nervous about her performance tonight. I'm with the director, bro. Who ordered a pizza? No, he's all good. He's with me. Come on. Come on. Hey, bro. What's up? Listen, I need to get in it. No. You don't understand, I'm the director of this film. See, the copy you're about to show has the wrong sound. It's, it's I gotta come in there and tweak it. You're showing the wrong sound for the print of the copy. Well, I was given specific orders by the producers not to let anyone in the booth. So why don't you all go back to your seats or I'll...
Turn it on. Why isn't it working? I, I thought you went to film school, bro. Shut up. We have a real problem here. You wake up. You up? Wake up. How do I turn the projector on? Kiss my ass. This is a union projection booth. You're not supposed to be in here. <laughs> Listen to me. I'm risking my whole career to give the people what I believe in. This is about integrity. Baby, they don't call me the detonator for nothing. Oops. It was so amazing. It was so romantic. I'm so honest I'm watching and you, man. true. And it was epic. Brilliant, man. Totally it's so hot. David! I like your work. You're a talented director. Thank you. How'd you like a three-picture, $100 million deal with Dreamcatcher Films? Thanks. But I'm sticking to independent films. Maybe next time. Hey, Brett. Wait up, guys. Go. So this is it, huh? The road less traveled. Who do I think I am? John Cassavetes? Ah, don't beat yourself up, kid. 